my everything pink luxury wish list. Let's get into it, bitches. Epidal labio que tengo puesto para este video is by MAC Cosmetics and it's called Snap. Numero uno is these Vene Keovila, I'm not sure if I'm saying that right, embellished crystal heels. I can't even scream because my throat hurts today. These are so stunning. So stunning. I feel like if I was to put these on my in my on my shoes, on my feet, I will feel like the brunette Cinderella. There's never been a brunette Cinderella. I will feel like the brunette curly haired version of Cinderella if there ever was one. These cost $1,490. They're in pink. They look so sexy and crystallized and gorgeous. And you know, these are the type of heels that during the nighttime, they're going to be twinkling and glittering from afar. I mean, I could just picture them. But let me be the first one to tell you that rest assured, if I hit the lotto tomorrow, these will be on my feet. Look at those. These pink aviator sunglasses by linda farrow they cost 222 dollars they're not the end of the world but that price scares me to be honest with you because you know i don't want to lose sunglasses sunglasses are things that you end up losing like earrings and things like that so i'm always more trepidatious when i am going to even think about embarking on that trajectory but these are so cute and pink i don't know why i am drawn to pink i think i'm gravitating towards pink because everywhere i look now here in new york city which i find so magical i see pink blossoms all over the place and the color is just so rich and beautiful and light and such an industrial city that it really stands out i would love these I would love, 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 love these, but I am so scared to go that route, to be honest with you. Uh, let me keep going because I'm going to convince myself to buy it right now when it's on my wish list for a reason, because I'm wishing for it. Numero tres. This is by Issa Boulder. I've never bought anything by this designer. This is a bathing suit and look how cute this is. I just find it so different. The color is so unique too. It's like bordering between pink and slight lavender such a unique color it's gorgeous the top itself costs 95 dollars and the bottoms are 130 dollars i am planning to go to aruba in august so these would be amazing i don't know something about it like the rouging on it it reminds me of seashells and it looks so cute it has like that silky material like that shiny material makes it look even softer and i think it's just so beautiful we love these i'm gonna wait a little bit and see if maybe they go on sale these are on my wish list hit list wish list kill list same difference numero cuatro oh my god how cute are these these are by dolce and gabbana these are so cute i mean it's very rare that you find denim in different colors and to have it in this vibrant pink like this pink that actually stands out it's stunning to me it's gorgeous it's fun it's cool it's very city-esque and new york and like i love that new york downtown type of look and this is something i was sporting on harpy but the damn price is killing me this cost 995 dollars for a pair of denim is just just a tad ridiculous it's ridiculous i mean i'm like damn these look so so good I love these. I will buy this right away. They're on my wishes. Numero cinco. Jacquemus. Jacquemus. I swear everything that comes out by this brand is just sexy. It takes me to like Miami Beach, to Greece, to Brazil, to like a beach. Those sexy, sultry nights type of vibe. Look at this dress. This is gorgeous. And this lie cool tone pink it's stunning it looks silky like that shiny material it's rouge it's low cut in the back mm, it just begs for me to have a glass of wine and just get drunk Tamar, this costs 635 dollars but yes this is on my wish list such a beauty and all it's cool toned pink glowy <laughs> Numero says Dolce and Gabbana. Look at these sneakers. I love them. It's so funny, like for some weird reason, I'm not too much of a fan of Dolce and Gabbana. In other words, Dolce and Gabbana is never at the forefront of the first things I want to look at. Not to say they don't have beautiful things, because they do. It's just not my favorite type of aesthetic overall. 
But man, look at these in this gorgeous millennial pink. This pink is like my favorite type of pink. It's like that modern millennial type of pink. The fact that they're like hard with that light color is such a juxtaposition. These cost $1,095. No wonder I hate Dolce Gabbana because who the hell is going to touch that price for a sneaker? Absolutely stunning absolutely stunning i would love to get my hands on this damn 1095 dollars for a pair of sneakers is killer i mean unless you're maybe louis vuitton Siete. Oh my god i just can't with the shoes this is by a brand i never heard of it's called sebastian milano and look how gorgeous this bright pepto bismoly type of pink sexy heels look and then that rope detail going going down on the front of the sandal and then the wraparound beautiful lace oh my god i love these they're gorgeous it gives me again beach vibes summer vibes with this pink and i have a beautiful tanning so gorgeous these cost 390 dollars these also come in different colors and like black and this turquoise stunning color and like that kelly bottega veneta green these are on my wish list and they might be in my wishes for quite a while. Ocho. Oh my god. I never heard of this brand either. I believe it's pronounced Junayin. Pretty sure I butcher that name. <laughs> but look how sexy this shirt is. So simple, so sexy, so satiny and soft and shiny, but yet makes such a freaking impact. I am in love with this top. I don't know. The color, the cut how modern contemporary and even like futuristic vibes i get from this absolutely sexy i can see myself wearing this with something close to what's going on here with like a silky very loose low effort type of skirt and then some heels and give it that you didn't try hard effortless type of look but still look absolutely flawless this cost 360 dollars which kills me it's in my wish list in the event that one day it actually will go down in price and maybe i could get my paws on them that bitch I should give her a name like cruella or something and lastly is this Versace Jeans Couture t-shirt. This is just a cute t-shirt, a hot pink, hot fiery type of t-shirt. Very sexy, modern, very beachy, very summery. And this is like the type of t-shirt that everybody needs, right? We all wear t-shirts. I could wear this with like some distress, hot shorts and some heels. This also comes in a plethora of other colors ranging from like baby blue to lavender to black. They all look stunning. This cost $99. It's not the end of the world, but given that it's a t-shirt, it's like $99 for a t-shirt, but it's in my wish list in the event it actually goes down. Are you a pink fan? Which is your favorite piece?